it is a very cold, wet, and dreary day on the Las Vegas Strip with lots of rain, lots of flooding, but y'all, we do not let that hold us back from having a good time. Hi, everybody. My name is Amy. I'm a tangerine, and in this video today, I'm going to show you all around Mandalay Bay. I think we're going to do the Sea Life Aquarium, and we're just going to have a fantastic Las Vegas day. So let the Las Vegas Mandalay Bay edition adventure begin. I don't know what that was. Ready to go, the feeling of thirst, desire to be a rock in my heels. I'm numbers of poison, flows in my veins, guess I got used to avoiding the pain. I know my scared to ride, my scared back in. Time for 33 a.m. There are going to be people drinking and still wearing their clothes from the night before. But look, mini golf is coming. That'll be really fun. Better is the Swingers Golf Club. I mean, it's a genius name, really. We're going to do that today, the Shark Reef Aquarium. My sister and I came out here at like 4.30 a.m. because I had to drop her off at the airport. She is flying back home and we're drinking. We're drinking, it's Vegas. I'm kind of surprised by the amount of people that are actually like out here. It's like the party is still going. Moolah. Planet Moolah, that's where I want to live, Planet Moolah. We do have a Starbucks, not quite open yet. And then here is where you can head right over to the Luxor, which I'm gonna do. Later, I, me and my sister had dinner at Wahlburgers last night. It was incredible. Highly recommend that place. Wonder Woman House of Blues. It's absolutely beautiful. It was packed last night. Uh, your girl went to bed at 9 p.m. last night. But we had to be up super early for my sister's flight. So that's the reason behind that. Nice about Mandalay Bay that I really liked is this tram station. So you can get on the tram for free and go a little bit further down. Like we walked yesterday on the strip and, it, and we got like 25,000 steps, but I mean the tram helps a little bit. It's nice to have that here. I used to explore this early in the morning. You know, I always feel like a little weird when it's like super busy at a Las Vegas resort to film it. But this feels pretty good, so I'm happy to be here with this. A few shops here. There's the lobby. I had to come this way because I had to find where checkout was because my it's my sister's reservation and she's going to be up in the air when it's checkout time so I had to figure out how to do the checkout without her. You have express checkout and then you just drop your key in there and that will check you out but that you can also check out on your phone. Resorts like Margaritaville and Orlando have these like these displays behind their desk here. It looks so classy and beautiful. You can check out on your TV in the room. Well, that's super easy. All the elevators are depending on what floor you are on. We are on floor three, so we go this way. But I think I'm gonna go down and get something to drink. I'm gonna get some water. You can get water in your room, but I'm sure it's quite pricey. It's like super classy here. It's really beautifully done. Look at these chandeliers. Or it's hard to do it with two hands. You have to have a room key for freaking everything, which is good for security. Can you believe it? sleeping the audacity it's Vegas we got things to do people it's room 3206 
let's do a little Mandalay Bay room tour. It is the day after we spent the night here last night and film anything. We just had a good time. But this is what, so what this is what the room looks like, you know, already used. So the beds are a little mussy. Uh, mine a little bit worse than my sister's. Um, but look at this design here of the headboard. And y'all, these beds were so comfortable. The shower was incredible. It was like super hot water. Everything about this place. This is like my new favorite resort to go to. It has been fantastic. Really nice seating area here. And then over here. Dig back. See, I have to bring Disney World with me wherever I go. So I've been getting a lot of compliments on that bag on this trip. Um, they do have accoutrements. But if you even pick it up they will charge you for it so do not touch do not even lift it up to look at it you can scan the qr code for the prices i'm sure they're insane and then down here is the same thing for the refrigerator it is a wet bar it's got like all kinds of stuff and i'm not going to open it because i don't want it to charge but there's like soda and beer and snacks and stuff um it's not for personal use so like i, I bought a water i cannot Put it in here because you're charged a fifty dollar fee if you use that for personal use, which is insanity to me. Insanity to me. I don't understand why the MGM resorts don't have a fridge storage for you, and they have a little nice desk here. I did some TikTok sitting here last night. Nice TV, nice mirror down the hallway here, so you can check yourself to get ready. The bathroom has two really large closets here first one and it has a light that comes on when you open it up and it has the safe um, ironing board iron lots of places to hang your clothes like if you come here and you have a, like a nice dress this is really nice which is really large as well has where you know the luggage rack and then more like a shelving and more places where you can hang your things back at the beds here oh my god it's just super comfortable super I, I i live here now i do not want to leave it's fantastic check out the bathroom and they have a really large nice soaker tub my sister took a shower and she's like this shower is amazing you gotta use the shower so i used the shower i it was hot water just a wonderful shower like we, we didn't want to get out of it. It was incredible. And they have like a little butterfly here. And here is like really nice that they got double vanities for people to get ready at the same time. And then that door is where the toilet is at. Really, really nice bathroom. Mirror here where you can get ready. And then the lighting in the mirror is really nice. Just really nice. I mentioned it comes with everything that you need. There's body lotion, hand wash, shower. It has body wash, conditioner, and shampoo. We're on the third floor here, and we're facing where the beach area is. It's kind of a bummer because the beach area is not open yet. When it gets light out, we'll go down there, and I'll show you around that area. It's kind of a bummer. It's got a lazy river and everything, so that's going to be really cool for the summer. My sister has been in town and the poor thing, okay, I've been a disaster. This week has just not been good. The weather was atrocious uh, for no reason at all. It's been like really nice here in Nevada. So that sucks. I was sick. Um, also, just out of the blue, okay, four years ago for COVID, I fell and broke out my whole set of teeth in the front here right and it was like five thousand dollars to fix that was 2020 we all know what 2020 was like but this week right before this trip out to the strip uh i broke fractured this tooth and you're like oh i'm thinking no big deal one fractured tooth i wasn't even doing anything okay y'all it just freaking broke right off in half it's like half a tooth so I go to the dentist and I'm like thinking, no big deal. The whole bridge is fractured. Um, okay. So the thing is when you have a bridge done, your insurance will not cover it 
Um, they'll only cover a bridge once every five years. And the warranty on this bridge is one year. So the entire thing is going to be out of pocket. And guess how much? Guess how much that's going to cost? Seven thousand dollars for one a fractured tooth because they got to take the whole thing apart and do the whole spiel again <sighs> so i'm in a I've, I've been in a foul mood uh one i've been in pain um and i've been sick and the weather's atrocious so my apologies to my sister I'm trying to tell her and the next time she comes out, we'll go to Disneyland and, and, and things will be better. We'll have a better time. We did have a good time though. It was a lot of fun. This resort is incredible. Vegas is so much fun, especially with when you're with someone that knows how to have a good time. So in spite of all that, we have had an incredible visit with her here. And it's like so nice to be so close to the Strip. And I, like, literally, I can just bring her to the airport super quick. So, yeah. Let's hope for, like, a better week next week. Like, uh, this is how bad my week is. People are telling me, you know, the only way is up. When you're lying on the floor, you can only get up, right? The floor drops out on you sometimes, y'all. So, but we're not going to. We're, we're not going to go there. Let's go have a good time. Let's go have a good time. Haitian lover's kit that you can purchase. I'm tempted to kind of like do it. <laughs> like, <laughs> because the room is under my sister. So how, you, how do you explain that charge? How do you explain that charge? But no, she's awesome. I won't do that to her, but it, it, would, be, it would be funny. So you can check out right from the TV. And I really think we are going to do that. The aquarium. The sun has rose in Las Vegas, Nevada. Uh, excuse the glare here. But this gives you an idea of what our room view was. We are on the third floor here. And you can get kind of a good view of where the pools are. There's a whole beach back here with a lazy river. Uh, it's closed, but we're gonna go down there and check it out so you can see what it looks like in case you ever want to come here and stay. Really nice. You can do a fit check. Um, I'm not looking very Vegasy. Uh, I'm looking very Walt Disney World. I got the coat on because a uh, cold, rainy, gross. Uh, yeah, I've never been normal, as you can tell. You are watching a channel that is a tangerine. Let's go! Vacation pool area, beach pool area. If only it was a real beach. I miss Florida so bad. How beautiful this is. Look at that chandelier. Get out of here. Work out on your vacation, you can. There is a cardio center here on the level just below the casino. Attached to the Four Seasons Resort as well if you ever want to stay at Four Seasons. You bring your dog, they do have a relief area for your pet. Very, very pet friendly here. Here is the spa area. If you are into that. Think this through, it's raining and I have this camera and I don't have an umbrella and I don't have a hoodie either. So I don't know how long I'm gonna be out here, but this is the Mandalay Bay Beach area. This is where you can go swimming with the Lazy River, and pools and spas. It's really fantastic. About this, is I'm 5'0". I wonder if I even <laughs> measure up. Okay, it's fun being a little person. Y'all, this is really strange. No one is out here. I can't imagine why. I can't imagine why. It's, you know, gorgeous out. Or Seasons area. This is their section. We are straight ahead. Now the pool areas close down for now. Delano or Delano Resort? I don't know. I don't know anything about that resort. Uh, but there is looking back at Mandalay Bay where we are staying at. And what's cool about this is this is like a trail in case you want to run or walk. You can loop around and get your exercise in in case walking the strip is not enough for you. So. 
gorgeous. How gorgeous is this? It's like very quiet back here too. So like you're on the strip, but you have this like little oasis. It's perfect. It's my new favorite resort. It, it, it's amazing. Fine. A lot cheaper than what I paid. <laughs> Let me tell ya. There's a lazy river section. Gorgeous. Love this. I can't feel my hand right now because it is a freezing. But this is what it looks like. Have to come back. I'm going to have to come back. Isn't that what Drew Barrymore says? Dance in the rain. Dance in the rain. I'm ruining my Converse sneakers. Am I? What am I? Here's a view of that lazy river. Looks amazing, does it not? Mandalay Bay, who knew? Who knew? I mean, like, you're right on the strip and you're just like, you get this. You get the quiet and then you can go down to the crazy, super easy. For the aquarium up there, I am gonna put my stuff in the car because checkout is 11. So I'm gonna do that before we come. We're gonna come back for this. This is just such an incredible resort. But it's freezing, y'all. Let's go inside and explore the casino area. My life. Yeah. Breaker. I'm not attiring myself appropriately. This is Vegas. This is anarchy. It's really cool. Kind of remind, remind me of Margaritaville in Orlando. Be easy to navigate this resort. Everything is well, like the signage is perfect. You don't get lost. Yeah, the strip, like everything was broken. Why was why is everything broken on the strip? Can, can I asking for a friend? Because this is cardio, okay? And I'm on vacation. Made it back to this casino level here. No words are needed. That is Vegas. Ram station, really super easy to get to. You can take this to the Luxor, the Oxcalibur, and you can even take this to the T-Mobile Arena in the park. I don't know what that is, but the, this is really helpful, the tram. Hours for the tram, so it's way earlier than that. Everything was closed down, but that's where it's at. Really super fun and easy to use. Cool. Really like that. And then you can get a tattoo right here. You can get a tattoo sinking everywhere in Vegas. But they do have one here in Mandalay Bay. Connected to Delano, uh, the Four Seasons Hotel, and then also the Luxor. So convenient. Starbucks is now open. It's like calling my name, but I did have a protein bar. Uh, I'm gonna think about it, maybe come back. You can go over to the Luxor and there's shops and eating and all kinds of activities up here for you this someday. This ice bar, it looks so cool. It looks really, really fun. It's right now, of course, but like you get a jacket and you go, it's a bar that you sit on like ice to drink. Really fun. Shopping that you can do here and it's like all the stuff kind of opens at 10 a.m. The city that never sleeps does in fact sleep. Well, for shopping, souvenir shopping. Burgers and my sister and I ate dinner here last night. Now I'll insert some clips of our food and experience. It was incredible. It was probably one of the best meals I've had. So good. Really, I've never eaten here before, but I highly recommend it. It was great. In fact, I might hear, come here again. Very, very good. My favorite store right here, Lush, was the Bath and Body. And it smells so good even from away from the store. I had to buy a bunch of this stuff last night. It's a Vegas restaurant is really good too. And there's Fat Tuesday. We already know how I feel about that. If you watch my Luxor video, I will put a link uh, below in the description below on my Luxor video when I stayed the night there. But we had a good time. Thank you to Fat Tuesday. We were at the Luxor. Super, super quick and easy to get to the Luxor. Facts. Just saying. Line at Starbucks. When does that ever freaking happen? It's a sign. I gotta get it. Their series here is the Nevada Starbucks cup. I feel like they should have a Vegas one. I think that would be more fun. Have a little one. A little one. Life changing. 
plus for this resort and casino is it does not smell like smoke you know it smells very good kind of gives me that Disney resort kind of a smell where they pipe in like a you know a citrusy scent it just has a very classy clean well smell kind of a vibe if that makes any sense at all you know it's not a lower tier resort do have a cafe if you want to get breakfast I am running on Starbucks here you can check in on your phone and then I highly recommend you coming to like a kiosk here this is by the lobby and getting a valid key it's always good to have that key in hand although you can just do it all with your phone but they make it super easy to check in and check out here I made the mistake of coming back to the room to charge my phone and I laid down and I promptly fell asleep uh, like I said the beds are super comfortable we are gonna say goodbye to this room if we have to I'm gonna go put everything in the car I've got parking paid for the entire day and we're gonna go do that aquarium so let's go after the aquarium stay tuned for some bonus footage where my sister and I went down the strip to the Bellagio. The last video I did for the Luxor, the Bellagio was like a lunar new year. Wait until you see what they are doing at the Bellagio for spring. It's absolutely beautiful. And I will put that right after the aquarium. So make sure to stay for that. Check out here and see how it works. All right, check me out. Are you sure you want to check out? No, I do not. But if I must, you have successfully checked out. Hope you enjoyed it. That was super easy. Let's go have some fun. Okay, remember how I said I broke this tooth? Uh, it's like just patched up just enough. It's it's so loose, y'all. It's gonna come out. Like if I just move, and I said to the dentist, like, I'm. It's gonna come all the way out. Like, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna be walking around with no front tooth. And he's like, well, we'll just put a dummy one in. But I was telling my sister, like, wouldn't it be so funny if we're just going to, like, it would, I'd be in the Hangover movie with, like, an empty tooth. Like, that would just be so funny. I mean, own it. Let's be the Hangover. Well, no, let's not be the Hangover. I don't know. They had a good time on the Hangover movie, though. They had a good time. But she's hanging in there. She's hanging in there. My life, my life, I tell ya. About 10 a.m. and you can see the difference. A lot more people here. Thank God I'm not worrying about getting breakfast. Go back this way yesterday. There's a lot of, this looks really cool. This eatery here. They have a lot of places to eat back here on the way to the aquarium. And they have a second Starbucks over here, much busier. I'm glad we got in when we did. Before the aquarium and we can even get married here. If you want, there's a wedding chapel this way. It was open today. I wonder if it was just closed because of the weather yesterday. It was really icky. And of course, I turned my room key in already, so we can't go check that out. But it looks really cool from up here. You can really get the gist of it. A day late and a dollar short, I tell you guys. This is my life. Lifeguard out there is open. It's open. It's still dreary out. I still wouldn't do it, but it would be nice to go down there food court back here. They got a Johnny Rockets, a Nathan's Subs, Green Plus, and they even have a Subway over here. Aquarium is very, very popular. Here is where you get tickets. It's $29 for an adult, savings for military and children. It's about a half hour.
because it was very quick. Uh, very cool. $29. Not so sure. Not so sure. I really like the turtle. I like the stingrays. I like the sharks. Whole another section. It's a virtual reality. You can get a selfie right here, and this is included in the price of your ticket as well. And we're just waiting for the theater to open. This is a virtual reality thing. Let's hope I don't get sick. So I get nauseous. Reality. Mask and everything. I'm so scared. <laughs> How's this gonna go? I don't know. All right, I survived the virtual reality. Virtual reality. It was on um, tiger sharks and how essential they are to the ocean. It was it was pretty cool. I got a little sweaty, but I'm all right. I love Mandalay Bay. It's quickly become my favorite resort so far on this trip. I do plan on going to as many of the resorts as I can. Paris, Paris is a top tier, and then New York, New York. But on the next video, we're gonna head over to the Luxor and do the Titanic exhibit. I felt like it needed its whole own video. So I will see you there. And thanks for watching. And until we meet again, my friends, bye. It's been fun. Let's do Mandalay Bay, Las Vegas again. Bye. All right, update. I did go to the Titanic exhibit, but there are no videos at all. I will insert some photos here and it was totally worth it. I loved it. I got some things. Um, yeah, I would totally do that again, but sorry, no video. So I will see you guys soon. Bye. Completely changed out to spring. It looks incredible. And tours. The smell. Oh my gosh, the plane doesn't even like, stop. sister and I <laughs> we got hit on on the Vegas strip last night and she was on the phone with her husband and he was like whatever whatever it was so funny 